We have the Peacemaker's Canoe, uh, a temporary art installation on the waterfront at Harbour Square Park next to Jack Layton Ferry Terminal. Um, this is a beautiful piece by an artist called Jay Havens. Um, he is a, uh, an artist of Haudenosaunee and Scottish uh, descent. The art installation is based on a story Indigenous artist Jay Havens heard many times while growing up. The tale of the peacemaker who builds a shining canoe. That happened a thousand years ago. Um, and it is an important uh, story, uh, you know, it, in, in, in Indigenous communities. Uh, it is about a, an, uh, a Wendat uh, diplomat that set out from the, the shores of uh, the northern shores of Lake Ontario um, with a, a message of peace for all the nations of the world. He builds the canoe so that he may depart from his homeland to take the new shining canoe around to unite the people. So it's a really, really beautiful story. It was very important for Jay to highlight something, a story that he'd, he'd always heard from since he was a child. It's also critical that non-Indigenous peoples hear about these stories and learn about other, other layers of history on the waterfront. And turning attention to the waterfront is the main goal of Waterfront Toronto. Waterfront Toronto's mandate is all about um, creating dynamic and, uh, and, and active spaces on the waterfront and reorienting the, uh, the, the, the city towards the lake. Other installations are beginning to be installed along the waterfront. The Peacemaker's Canoe will be in the Harbour Square Basin until September. Well, to read the full story about the Peacemaker's Canoe and to find out what other art has been installed along the waterfront, you can go to our website, citynews.ca slash extras. In Toronto, Audra Brown, City News.